Terrifying moments when bullets soar through the air outside an apartment complex in Portsmouth, and the shootout is all caught on camera. Turn on your side to my Elena Valores is looking into what happened. Well, Regina, we started looking into this when the video was shared with us on social media. I spoke with people who live in the Harbor Square apartments today, and they all knew about this shooting, even if they weren't home at the time. When you see the video, it is easy to understand why. It looks like something out of an action movie. A group of people with some serious firepower taking aim at a person across an apartment complex parking lot. But it's not out of a movie. It's surveillance video from the Harbor Square Apartments in Portsmouth. They came looking for, uh, I guess, some residents that stayed out here and gunshots were fired into the apartment and everything where they were, they was at. Fortunately, no one was 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 hit, and that was that was the blessing. Sharon Fowler is the maintenance supervisor at the apartment complex. He was stunned when he saw what happened. Oh my gosh! You know, I, that, it was a shock seeing teenagers with military-style weapons and knowing how easy it is for them to get it on the streets. You know, it, it was shocking. You know, not seeing it at your place of work. According to the timestamp on the video, this happened just before 10 p.m. on Monday, November 9th. Fowler says they are still fixing some bullet holes in the building. They already replaced the windows. Windows were shot out as far as um, all the apartments, as far as because uh, there's four apartments, two upstairs, two up um, downstairs. Each one of the windows was shot out. A resident who asked to not be identified says she's ready to leave. So seeing the video, I was like, dang, it was that many people. I'm glad I wasn't out here. I definitely was like, it's probably time to move. So now, like, I'm looking for, like, a new apartment so I can move. She and Fowler are grateful that no one was hurt, and they hope a shootout like this doesn't happen again. Portsmouth police say it is an open investigation. They can't provide any additional details at this time. We've reached out to the property manager, but have yet to hear back. In an hour, I'll have more from Fowler on what he hopes prevents something like this from happening again. In the newsroom, I'm Maria Elena Baloris, 10 on your side.